Hello everyone, I'm going to show you how to 100% Pirate's Grotto. If this video helps you, please like it, leave a silly comment for the algorithm, and don't subscribe to me. Okie dokie, let's get started. I'm right outside of the front. There's nothing in that area, and we're just going to jump down here. Good stuff. Now there is a bunch of stuff pretty early on that we can collect. Depends if we fight the enemies or not. So we can jump on this boat and kind of walk across. And there we go, we get that shine sprite. Now I believe there's also, yes, right there, the first star piece. Okay, so once we go over this way, there's going to be spikes. So let's go ahead and change into this ghost girl and then go across. Alright, they do take a while to come up. There we go. Make sure you go down. I was pretty close on that one. Looks like I only needed to do it once, though. Alright, so let's just keep moving forward. I don't think there's anything in this room either, except for those, those uh, <laughs> what's it called? Bullet gun guys. Alright, so they'll automatically just hit you, and they uh, don't give you any experience, which is uh, kind of crummy. So you really want to avoid them as much as possible and then go straight for what's shooting them and hit that instead. Then you can fight these guys and take them out. Alright, now we're in the next room. We're going to just hop across and then I guess I'm going to have to use Yoshi to get across here. Oops, wrong guy. There we go. Nice. What's this for again? Item fits perfectly in there. Oh yeah, that's an item that we'll see later in the game. I'm going to take out these guys. Okay, now that we're in this room, we're just going to hop our way up. And there's going to be another Shine Sprite right here. Alright, what we want to do actually is switch to uh, the turtle and then shoot the shell over there. And there we go. Got that Shine Sprite. Okay, so once you're in this area, you're going to want to get your bomb guy. And just throw him up here. And he'll take that switch out. And then we can head inside. Okay, once inside here, we actually have a star piece right here. There we go. Perfect. So let's just continue forward. We're just going to go through this area here. And into this room. Once in this room, there's a few different complicated things you can do. Now, the first thing you can do is you can just jump on this platform. And then switch yourself to Coops. So what we want to do is just wait till we're here, then hold X, keep holding, and then jump up. Alright, and then switch to Yoshi, and let's just wait until we can get this key. I think you could probably actually just make the jump. Just using Yoshi to be safe. Okay, good. Now what we're going to do is we are going to do the same thing again with the Koopa. There we go. Go up there again. Wait for that to fall down and we're going to jump on that box. There we go. And just wait for it to go back up. Once it's all the way on the top, can we make this jump? Oh. Oh. Get that shine sprite, and then keep walking down the barrels until you fall into one and get a star piece. Nice. Now we just gotta head back to that previous save point, because now we have the key to open up the door. Okay, so here's uh, where we're gonna open up the door. Use the grotto key, and let's head inside. Okay, once inside, you wanna ground pound right around there to get yourself a star piece. Nice, and then we're going to head into the next room. I use Koopa, uh, your turtle boy, to get this. Alright, and then we are going to spin and turn into our ball. There we go. Just, all you have to do is watch out for the ones on the bottom. Oh, darn it. I'm trying to do it too fast. Let's do it again. Alright, just roll yourself right into the next room. And right here we should find a hidden block. So we can get that shine sprite. Nice. Alright, 
times you get this thing. Alright, so let's go ahead and jump on all these barrels and go all the way across. Alright, once you finally made it across, let's just go ahead and use our bomb boy to blow up this rock. There we go, just head inside. Okay, so once you're in the next room here, just use this Vivian girl to uh, dodge these bullet bills. So, let me shoot, just go underneath. And, uh, go ahead and whack these boys. Okay, we finally made it all the way over here to this save point. We're going to head inside this broken ship. Inside will be a treasure, but before you get it, go behind it to get this. Nice. Let's go ahead and open up the chest. There's also another chest in the back. Okay, so once we're out of the boat, we're just going to go over here and let's run into a boat. Head all the way back to the save, one of the save points. A long walk. Okay, so I'm back at this room with the save spot for yours. We're gonna go back up here and cross here again. Whoops! Don't jump in the water like I did. All right, let's go through this door and use this boat thing right here. Let's go ahead. Oops. And turn into a boat and go back this way. Go this waterfall and right here will be a pretty powerful good badge. I think it's a defensive badge. Open her up. Yeah, it's a defense plus partner badge. Once we're back in this room, we're going to go down the waterfall. End up back here. I'm just going to sneak through this gap and go this way. Just keep heading straight until you can't hit go straight anymore. Okay, let's unboat right here and jump across to get this handle. Nice. Jump right here. And then we're going to make our way back. All right, once back in this room with the winch, we're going to use that handle that we just got. Go ahead and get it started. All right, so we got to come back to this room here and turn into a boat once again and fall down the waterfall so we can go through the door that we just opened up. Nice. Okay, there's nothing really to be found in this room, so let's just sneak through these barrels and go through here. Now there's going to be waves here, though they're pretty easy to get around. But when you get to the end... If you just stick to either the top or the bottom, you should make it much easier for yourself. So I'm just going to stick to the top, see how it's dodging all those waves. And then there's just one wave for me to dodge, and then just continue on the top and get through it quite easily. If you stay in the middle, you're going to get hit a lot easier. Okay, once we're in this room, we're going to find a bunch of toads. Okay, so let's go all the way over to where the toads are hanging out. And we're just going to unboat right here. And then jump down this pipe. Okay. So you're going to go all the way across and up that pipe right there. And we're going to go and turn into a paper airplane. And we're going to go to both the pipes. All right, so press B while you're in the air. Unfold yourself. Do it for this pipe and the other pipe that's right ahead of it. All right, once you hit both switches, all the toads will jump out of there. And then you got to turn into a paper plane again and land on the boat. There we go. Just hop through. Whoops. Just hop across and go see the toads. And that'll be it for this room. Okay, so once you head through this door, you're going to be fighting the boss, and that's pretty much it for this uh, dungeon after you fight the boss. Just a bunch of cutscene stuff, but if you go ahead and look at the map, we do have all the star pieces and shine sprites. So if this video helped you, please like it, leave a silly comment for the algorithm, and don't subscribe to me.